It's been 20 years since the flower carpet ground cover roses were released with a storm of popularity right across the world. Now since then, breeders from across the globe have attempted to copy them. They've introduced new varieties and of course, different colours, but there's been nothing like the originals as far as performance in the garden goes. The world's most popular and biggest selling collection has been the flower carpet roses, introduced to us by Anthony Tesla International. Anthony's rigorous testing regime and personal trial garden supervision has seen only the best performers selected for the newer colours as they've been released over the years. Adding a ground cover into a rose garden bed is really good because it cools the soil down. A nice dense covering like this also smothers weed seeds out and most importantly, it cools the soil reducing evaporation. Now this is really important for roses during the summer months. They hate heat stress. So this is a good way to keep them looking great. So my plan with the new rose garden is to soften the edges of the garden beds by planting agapanthus as borders, and then to graduate the front line of the rose shrubs by adding flower carpet ground cover roses. I've already transplanted some along the top section and they're booming away already. The bottom section will be highly visual to people arriving or passing by our garden, so it makes sense to continue the plantings all the way around the garden bed. The range of colours includes pink splash, scarlet, red, pink, apple blossom, white, coral and a beautiful gold. And the great thing about this collection of plants is they're not only disease resistant, but they flower for a good nine to ten months of the year, so the need for annual colour in this bed is negated. The key to success with these plants, well, there's not a lot you've got to do. If I could give you a bit of advice, it's probably feed them on a regular basis and make sure you prune them, particularly after they finish their flower flushes. This just stimulates more and more flower production. You know, they are just fantastic garden plants. They're disease resistant, even the aphids don't like them. And get a load of that. That's gonna be sensational color in just a few weeks time.